Several years ago, I actually decided to build a new Ferris wheel for on the Choo Choo Barn, totally from scratch, of course, which is how this one was built. And after I started, I saw on the Ellen DeGeneres show that she was teaming up with Brad Pitt to build homes for the victims of Katrina. Now, I know there are a lot of people, very famous people, with train layouts, and I decided I'd build this Ferris wheel and donate it to Ellen so that she could auction it off on her website. Uh, my daughter made a really funny story, uh, you know, this little booklet based on the house, uh, the story of the house that Jack built, and it was called The House That Tom Built, because we felt sure that my custom-made Ferris wheel was going to bring enough money to be able to build at least one house. And so, I mean, my daughter cut out these pictures, and, it was, well, actually, you know, you had to see it to appreciate how cleverly done it was. And I actually put Ellen and Portia in one of the seats. I put Mama in, on a uh, bench, sitting, waiting. And uh, I actually made an Ellen truck. It took over 100 hours to build this thing, literally. And, I mean, it was actually gorgeous. I, I really was very proud of it. I even custom made a wooden box for this thing to get shipped to because it was going from Pennsylvania to California. And I didn't want to take any kind of chances of having it uh, damaged in shipment. And I shipped it overnight UPS, so it would only be in shipment one day, and I insured it for $7,000. Well, we didn't hear anything from the Ellen people, but I thought, oh well, this was right when they were changing from uh, one studio to another, so we'll probably hear from her in the fall, you know, that maybe she'll be able to still auction this uh, Ferris wheel off. Well, we didn't hear her. So we began emailing and sending letters. Uh, actually, I believe my wife Linda sent probably 11 letters and many emails, but never heard a word back, nothing, whether they received it, whether they didn't receive it. Well, by that time, it was way too late to uh, try and collect any kind of insurance money. Uh, and I really fear of what may have happened to this thing. Um, we actually got the, uh, the signature of the person that signed for it that next day, but that really now is, is you know, it doesn't really matter. Uh, I just hope that it's still sitting in a warehouse on, a st on the studio lot somewhere, and someone will be able to find it, and that she can still use it. She can still maybe auction it off and still help some of the people Katrina because they still need help. And I really, really cringe to think that someone took it and damaged it because it was really a beautifully crafted work of art. Uh, well, maybe someday I'll have the time to build another one. But anyway, here I am. I have the Ferris wheel from the Choo Choo Barn here, and uh, I, I, I took it apart. I started taking it apart. I pulled these sides off because there were a couple of these pieces of styrene that were broken, so I had to replace them. And I'm going to repaint this, and I'm also going to change the drive mechanism because the drive mechanism that... Uh, was on the one that went to Ellen was a much simpler drive mechanism. So I'm going to replace this drive mechanism that's under here with one that's like um, that was like on there. It was just a lot easier to, to, to manage. And I also have these little LED units that I built a number of years ago that I would love to be able to get them up here so that they light up at nighttime. Now, whether that's going to happen or not, I'm not sure yet. Uh, I'm going to see what I can do with it. If not, well, I tried. Okay, I got the drive mechanism off, the old motor and all the pulley units uh, off of it. So it's basically plain underneath here. And you can see that when I built this, this thing is very well balanced. It runs on ball bearings that I have on either side. So it is, I mean, it is very, it's a very precise piece of, uh, of work. So what I'm going to end up doing is pull all this stuff off. I'll take all the old uh, landscaping off first. Then I'm going to get it. I'm going to clean it up real good and see what I can do with the lighting. Get that drive mechanism back on here. Get it painted and we're going to get it back up to the choo-choo barn as soon as I can. And I'll keep it, keep it posted. You know, we'll, we'll, we'll keep uh, some video going of while I'm working on it. 